Hey guys, in this video I'm going to be giving you guys my review and my step-by-step -step process of me cleaning my Nike Air Maxes and my Hoka's like I had stated in my review of my shoe collection in the last video. If you guys have not checked that out, you should go and check that out and don't forget to leave a like on this video and subscribe for more content and I will be starting this video. So, the first step that you need or it's like multiple things but in the first step you need a hard surface a dish brush or a normal brush any type of soap like dish soap like any soap foam soap I don't care just any soap and then you need to get um, water have like a water faucet or any wa like a water bottle water glass anything that can contain water soap and it has a hard um, counter or surface you need that then you need a rag towel don't use an actual towel because it can be stained easily and a rag towel won't and it's also made for that kind of circumstance and um yeah that's it so the second step is you need to get that brush and the towel and put the towel down on a hard on the hard surface and you get that brush and put soap on it and then put water over it lightly and then you want to get the side of your shoe and scrub it everywhere. Make sure to scrub hard along the whole shoe. And when you're done with that, um, put the water or only soap on the um, brush and no water included. So you can really spread the soap around. And once you've done that layer as well, then I want you to wash all the soap off and other water. And just put water on to spread the soap and water around and really clean it out. Let that dry after you use a towel around it for the fourth layer. And then you want to flip the shoe over. And I used a knife for this. And I just pick out all the little things that were crammed inside the um, traction area. And I um, used a knife for that. So everything's out now. And then when I was done with that, I put water on the bottom of the shoe. And used, a, used the rag towel. I picked it up and then I used it for my shoe to clean all the extra dirt that was sticking still. And then I used my knife after that for any other things and I repeated the process with the towel on top. Which really gave it like a real sparkle to it and I'd highly prefer to do that second layer. If you don't do it then what I did is that at the very last step I put in the laundry. You personally don't need to do that if you do the second layer. But I did that just to make it like shine a little extra and make it dry. And um, that is my step-by-step -step process. Honestly, I feel like it was um, a pretty easy process con considering that it, it doesn't cost that much at all. Like if you already have these like necessities inside your home, then you can easily do this and clean any shoe you want to. And I did not decide to do this for my Hoka's, but I'm going to do it next video. And I will show you guys the actual process of doing it if you did not understand how I did it this time around. But I hope you guys enjoy and I will be leaving a review on the Hoka's when I'm done cleaning them next video. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Leave a like and subscribe and comment down below for any other new videos. Thank you for watching.